morning everybody. Welcome to Orville's Everything Outdoors and Home Setting. Today we're in Franconia Notch, New Hampshire, uh, Lafayette Place Campground, and we're hiking up the Falling Waters Trail. And it looks like it's going to be a beautiful hike. That's a big waterfall ahead. We can get over to it.
that is nice. Now, we got to hike up there. Another beautiful waterfall. We're hoping to go at least to the top of Haystack Mountain. If not, Haystack, Lincoln, and Lafayette and back down. But it's looking pretty nasty and raining up here. That might turn us around. But we'll keep checking in. Okay, we're almost to the first peak. There's this checklist. Just figured I'd record it. You guys could pause it, read it if you want. And we go that way. Phone's on 15%. Hopefully I get to do more recording. Talk to you later. Okay, we're at about 3,300 feet right now. The top, the first peak is 4,700 4, feet. Camp is 13 or 1,400 feet. So we're we're over halfway there, and it's not too bad, but a little treacherous. But we'll keep you posted. Hey guys, we're about 500 feet from the top. Another couple hundred feet of elevation, and we'll be there. Okay, we did it. This is the top of Little Haystack Mountain, New Hampshire. It's not exactly. This is the Saturday after this hike that my stepson and I took. I'm on break. I'm cutting wood in a sugar bush, cleaning out everything that's not a maple right now. Um, but I wanted to get back about that hike. Um, we made the Falling Waters Trail all the way to the top, as you see, to Little Haystack. 47,000, uh, 4,700 feet. Um, and then my phone died between Little Haystack and Mount Lincoln. We continued the whole trip. We went to Mount Lincoln and then on to Mount Lafayette and then down the Greenleaf Trail that the Greenleaf Hut is on. About the time we got back to tree line before the hut, it started pouring. And it poured for the next three miles, probably a little over three hours. Um, the whole trip we walked from our campsite. So it was about nine miles. And it was one of the dumbest, best things I ever did. If I got to explain it that way, we couldn't see. I did go on youtube and watch some videos of other people that have hiked it and on a nice day i'm gonna go back um it's just unbelievable but it's very hard we got very wet that didn't help any and uh 
but we made the whole trip between eight and nine hours we guessed because we weren't paying attention to time because when we started hiking it wasn't the intention to do the full loop it was just go to the top and back down and we changed our mind but i'm glad we did um hope you like the video i'll try to put on some pictures that i took too and try to get more videos out Talk to you later.